Hey guys, uh, it's me again, and uh, today's composition lessons from N.C. Wyeth. Uh, this painting is titled The Opium Smoker. It was painted in 1913. It was illustrated for the American Magazine. A crazy thing about Wyeth is he visited opium dens uh, in Philadelphia uh, to do research. He talked about how miserable the withdrawals were, and how when he finally got all the junk out of his system, he felt human again. This painting has a dark feeling, slightly disturbing, a lot like a nightmare. You can see that the plot of this story is the bullseye, or a circle, within a circle, within a circle. So I'm calling it a bullseye. You can see here how he kind of chops the corners off of the darks. Kind of there. And then there's this right there. And a very strange, dark feeling right there. All right, get rid of this. He uses a very cold palette here. Um, he has little bits of um, warm colors. The red's kind of speckled through. But mostly it's predominantly cold and dark. One of the things I find really scary about this painting is that third element in the middle, the, the center of the bullseye, where your eye gets drawn to. This feels too dark to be a shadow. And it almost looks like some kind of specter. Almost kind of takes the shape of a person in here. And it's like this hand kind of becomes part of that scary person. I don't know if this was intentional, but this shadow feels too dark. You know, he's wearing black, and so if you were to paint the shadow, he probably would have chose that shadow. But instead he painted it really dark. So it feels like there's something else in there. Something sinister in this room along with those two characters. I mean, obviously this guy is the opium dealer. He's also very scary. He's very gaunt and pale. And his face is very yellow. He looks very jaundiced. I don't know. I just can't get over this monster in the middle here. It's what nightmares are made out of. I don't know how to explain it. Get rid of this. I don't know how to explain it, but it just doesn't sit well with me. There's, there's just some other piece in there that's really scary. And this could actually represent the addiction, which is a nice, interesting little uh, use of a metaphor for that. Bullseyes are generally very difficult compositions to uh, pull off. With a bullseye, it directs your eye right to the middle of the painting. And what's in the middle of this painting? Uh, that dark little monster in there. But you can see, show you everything else, this listens to your circles. They're all being listened, you know? The heads, obviously. Um, this monster. You know, this pillow. That tongue. See, it's all in there. You got all these circles happening everywhere. All right. <laughs> we got all those scribbles. We'll get rid of those. So I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I'll be wrapping up this video. If you'd like to read more about composition, uh, my friend Stapleton Kearns has a blog. I'll leave his link on this video. He's a riot. He's got such a great sense of humor, and his blog covers a whole range of everything an artist should know. He also made a fictitious character um, who was terrible at compositions. Um, so look for that. That's really funny. It's a really good read right there. All right, guys. Well, sorry for giving you nightmares. And uh, kids, remember, don't do drugs. Opiates kill. It's really sad. I've seen people ruin their lives with opiates. You know, Oxy and Percocets. Just, uh, you know, avoid that. Opiates kill. Not to mention ruining your whole entire life and your family and all your loved ones. You have a lovely rest of the day. And I'll see you next week.